replace PR, um, and social can be used to augment and amplify. And so what we want to do is when we look at an event, how do we integrate social throughout the event? So that's what I'm going to talk about. I think the very first thing I want to note, though, and this is from Constant Contact, um, so it might be a little biased on the email side, um, but what's important is that none of these are islands. They don't live alone. You can't just have a social media campaign. Or you could, but I don't recommend it. These should be strategic marketing campaigns that are then supported by pillars of channels. And so those pillars, you may decide that you know email and PR and social media are the only pillars that you're going to use. Or you may say, no, we're, we're going to use print for this and blogging. What, whatever those choices are, you need to evaluate what are the best communication channels. Um, social is very effective in amplifying a lot of those. So, for example, you know, if you have a blog post or you have a print piece, you can amplify. There is a timeline. There's a continuum that you should be following. Um, typically, you have a lot of before preparation, and then things kind of fall apart. So I want to emphasize that the during and after, especially in social media, are very important. They still have a, a lot of um, power and ability to get your message out and to follow up. Hashtags, they, they are so underused. Um, and, and the sooner you get a hashtag out, the more people can start following that stream. We have a plethora of hashtags, but make sure that you're really focused so that people don't get confused. Because what we want is other people, outsiders, other influencers, to be commandeering that hashtag and using it so that the people who couldn't make it actually can follow along live. Conversations can happen, and you're developing all this content for your program outside of just the content that you've already put out there. We generated 25% of all of our traffic in the after. Okay, that's a lot of traffic. So on SlideShare, um, the, the blog posts, the SMNRs, all of those. Okay, what happened? So when we were up against the traditional PR, we provided 77% of the traffic. Do the before. Plan before, plan during, and plan after. Okay, don't forget every event. And no matter if it's just a press release, there's a before, during, and after of these things. Don't forget.